I do feel like it's what I imagine a hard couple of months for you. How are you doing? You know, as long as the kids will be okay, I'll be okay. You know what I mean? That's that's the end all. Um, one day at a time. Like, what other cliches can I throw on top of each other? Rachel Lee Cook opening up to E.T. about her separation from hubby Daniel Gillies. The duo, who share two children, five-year-old Charlotte and four-year-old Theodore, announced they were splitting after 14 years of marriage with identical Instagram posts on June 13th. I don't know what I'm doing, so if anybody has any advice, seriously, tag me online. I'm all ears. Thank you. I'm listening. You are like a shining star to me. Like, you are always the nicest, cutest, and I think you just be you. No, seriously. Like, you're... Amazing. Do you feel like this is kind of time for like me time right now? My kids are four and five, so like when it's me time, somebody let me know. Gotta be um, hard. Yeah. No, but it's great. Like I went to the spa yesterday. Like you know, got a little help. Um, you know, just like took took an hour for myself, and that felt really good. It feels uncertain, and nobody warns you how hard adulting is gonna be. And I'm learning. I'm never bored, and I'm very grateful. How are the kids? That's like a long story. Um, Daniel's actually filming in New Zealand for almost three months now. And so we can't formally talk to them about what's going on until he's back because otherwise what it means is dad disappeared. And that's far from anything that Daniel would ever do or, or myself. Um, he's hopelessly devoted to them and like, you know, we're gonna get through this together. He's, he's an amazing person. I still consider him my very best friend and you know, we'll make it one way or another. Is the door still open then? The analogy I like to use is the characters stay the same, but this chapter is ending. We move forward. Does it make it that much harder that I have to be here asking you these questions that it's happening in the public? Because trust me, it's not my favorite thing to do. No, that was like, if you weren't so nice, I think it might have been difficult. But like, someone give this girl a raise. That was like such a, like, a sweet and lovely transition. And that, you, you're but doing I a great job. Mean it though, and it's not to talk about and I totally respect that. This is good preparation for like how I'm going to talk to my kids. Maybe this was a good stepping stone to that. I, apparently I'm in good company. It's it's LA. Shocking. Nobody, the funniest part about this was like nobody was that surprised. That almost surprised me the most. Everyone's like oh, what else? And what I was what should we have for dinner? Because I talked to you guys together and sure. I said what is the secret to the marriage and he said being married to Rachel. I'll, I'll tell you the, the secret. The secret is marry Rachel. That's the secret. There marry we go. Rachel. I'm going to tell her you said that. And so that's why I think I was really shocked. Like, it killed me a little bit, if I'm, I'm being so honest sorry. with you. We don't do this no, I get it. I take it very personally, usually. Yeah. When extra couples break up, I'm like, oh, we're probably next. Not really. They didn't think so then. But, um, you know, we got married when I was 24. Um, I think we were just a little bit ahead of the curve, so it feels like we're first, and that's hard. But, um... I don't know. I still love him to death. And he's gone and I miss him, but we're just going to forge a new path forward. And he'll be in your life forever. You guys share kids. Oh, yeah. He's not getting rid of me that easy. Thank you for your band. I really appreciate it. And speaking of sweet, the 39-year-old actress has been busy working on a new Hallmark Channel Christmas movie, which she was promoting at the network's 2019 TCA press tour event on Friday night. The Christmas Bride. Yes. When is it coming out? What can you tell us? I hope before Christmas. Like, I don't have any say, yeah. but I think before. I feel you like know? Yeah. You Maybe on, but I think I'm thinking before. Right before. Yeah. This is a bookstore. All bookstores have coffee. We don't have coffee. You've become such a staple in my home around the holidays. Do you yeah. now feel like a sense of like pressure? Are people coming up to you now more asking about Hallmark than they do from your famous amazing let's movies? Just say, let's just say people who love them some Hallmark, they're not shy about it and they love it so very much, as do I, and they want to chat. They know that if you work with Hallmark, that you're down, like that you're your family. And that's the way I feel when I'm here. And I don't know, I'm excited to be doing a Christmas movie because now it's like, that's inner circle time, Absolutely. you know? Yeah, that is inner circle. It's like, like, those are the slots that are safe for the favorites. I was ready, and now it's like, they put me in, so yeah. just gotta deliver.